chapter 9 of book 3. Nekmora. Another way of saying straight away, without a delay. Ritu. In the way, Greg Hensi of the Greeks. Ritu takes that genitive there. Ignis in rota. Fire in a wheel. You, know, you usually expect that to be accusative, but they can get around that by making it passive. So they were inferunted. So fire and wheel were brought in. And tum, then all genus, all types, you can see from the E that genus is a neuter, of flagorums, which are whips. So that was what was done. Orgator, something was increased. Opido, the adverb, usually means greatly or largely or something like that. So the maestidia, so his gloom and doom and gloom was what was increased. See, from the me, it was the me, the first person. Or in my more precisely, it was duplicated, it was doubled. So his um, gloom was doubled, it was increased, or more precisely doubled, uh, because integro, being whole and complete, saltium usually means at least, non liquid, I would not be allowed to, and that usually takes the dative as well. Um, so I would not be allowed to, it takes the infinitive, it takes the passive the deponent infinitive here, I'll not be allowed to die um, at all or at at least in uh, his whole body. It looks like they're going to torture him with a bit of fire, etc. Said anus, but the old woman, Illa, she, who or which, um, oh yeah, we'll say who had turbulent, who had disturbed everything with her flutter bussing, with her tears, she inquired, she said, Prius, prior. Optimus citizens, vocative, uh, you excellent citizens. Looks like uh, Prius Quam, we've got the, them separate. So prior to uh, this latrone, this bandit, the peremptorum, as you can see, it's an apposition, the, the killer of my triple genitives, of my uh, very beloved children, or my to be pitied children. See again, Pignorum, useless children here. Before you affix him to the cross, the torture, uh, permit it. This is the plural imperative. Uh, the corpora, which is a new the plural, permit the bodies of the necatorum of those who are dead to be revealed. Permit is one of the verbs that takes an infinitive. So that, uh, similar, at the same time, the former and a artist, in the contemplation of their form or shape or beauty and of their young age, uh, magus and magus, uh, more and more. In indignation, um, erecti, you'll be pricked up uh, to justice. Uh, pro modo, the savagery, savagery of this crime. Pro modo, um, this whole little section going together. In proportion to the savagery, you might want to say. Here's dictus. These words were said, everything we just saw in quotes. There's a bit of an applause with these words having been said. And Illico, on the spot, the magistratus did something to me myself. He ubited. He ordered the bodies. He ordered me myself to do something to the bodies, which were posited, uh, placed on the lecturer, on the beer, to detergorate, to uncover them with my hand. Me, myself. I was reluctant. Reluctatum me in the accusative. And DUI, for a long time, I was renuentum. I was very unwilling to in storo to uh, renew or to uh, look at again this uh, the preceding facinus, the crime that I'd done before with a new ostentation, with a new showing of it. But the lictors, here we have finally a nominative, because we started with an accusative, uh, by order of the magistrate, or by the order of the magistrates, um, quam with a superlative. So as instantissimo as they could, it was forceful as they would, they compelled These lictors, by order of magistrates, uh, compelled me, very much pressing me, and so identically. Finally, menum ipsem, the hand itself, uh, from that region of the sides, true denting. So it looks like they've forced or slapped his hand um, into the region where it should be. Um, Porygon, so they've stretched out my hands, 
super the cadavers themselves above the cadavers themselves into my own destruction or that's what he was thinking if they if they really didn't want to see these bodies so tandem a last evictus like the victus i was beaten or overcome by necessity succumbo i succumbed and lisette it looks like it's all low here but she just takes a subjunctive um in gratis so he wasn't doing this willingly i erupted the paleo i ripped back the uh, little hood or something retexi i've uncovered the corpora and so the bodies were uncovered or something like that die bono good gods quay fakis ray was the f the face or the appearance of this matter um quad monstrum what a monstrous looking sight and quay which was a repeat, rep uh, repenting, you know, which means sudden uh, mutatio, was sudden changing of my fortune. So it looks like this has revealed a sudden changing of his fortune. Quam, quam, anum. For although, yam already, in peculio persepina and orcus, orcus is the one of the gods of the underworld, persepine, I think she was abducted, went to hell, etc. Um, I was numeratus, I was numbered in the family, or the household of this underworld, these underworld figures. So although he thought he was counted in it, suddenly into contrarium faciam, suddenly into the contrary appearance, I was stupefactus. I was stupefied and hazy. It looks like he was stuck, uh, stupefied at what he was now seeing, a contrary appearance. And neither possum, so neither am I able, always takes the infinitive, to expedere, to unencumber it, or to explain. Nova Ilias Imogen Russian. So he wasn't able to give this in suitable words, as we see in the Ablative Absolute. Um, any rational reasoning of these new images of what he was now seeing. Nam Cadavera Ila. For those cadavers of the jugulated homonym of those killed men, uh, to yugulate literally means cut the throat, but they use it more broadly. Uh, there were tres inflati utres. There were three inflated uh, skins. Uh, they usually hold water or something, but um, looks like he's killed water bottles or something. Um, they were secti, so they were, had various cuts and four minor buses, which are holes. And as in the Vespertinum prolium, that uh, was his evening battle, uh, so record a bar means that, which I was recording in my evening battle of the night before. In these places, his locus, high antings, his gaping holes, high anting, uh, in which these latrans, these bandits, vulnerable, basically I'd uh, put wounds in them, where you get uh, vulnerable from in English. So he'd basically, they weren't three men he'd killed, they were just three inflated skins that he'd killed and all the holes lined up in the right places. Chapter 10. Tunk Illy. Something male. Then something male, Quorondum, of which Paulispa a little while ago, by astuteness or by some cunning, uh, here's the Illy. This laughter, uh, which a little bit before was cohibitous, which has been checked, now liberate, it was now free now to exhaust, to, to burst in the flames or to this, this uh, laughter started again burning throughout the plebs amongst the people. Okay. Hi, Gorde, Nimitate, Graculara, Illi. So it looks like we've got correlatives, Hi and Illi, so two groups of people. Now, Graculara. Um, I think I prefer Gratulara, which... So some people were uh, Gordae. They were rejoicing excessively with the excessivity of congratulating themselves or laughing. There's a there's an alternate viewpoint that the C is there, which I can't really find any information about it, which would mean that be cackling, but um, looks like very late Latin if it is. And anyway, this other group, the Illi, were sedaring, trying to soothe their dolorum, their pains, by compression of their hands to their bellies, to their ventresses. So that's how much they were laughing that they were painting themselves. 
et curte, and certainly the libuti, the I shows it's plural, uh, they were smeared with, is what it literally means, with lotidia, with happiness, so they were overcome with happiness, or there was a lot of happiness showing on them, and respectantes, present participle, plural, they were looking at me um, as they fracassaunted, as they left from the theatre, cuncti, again, all of them, the I shows it's plural. At ego, but I, ut primum, it means as soon as, uh, that Licinium, yeah, it was called a pallia earlier, but as I'd prender so I'd grabbed hold of this Licinium, this is the edge of the garment of the pallium which we saw. It's also sometimes used, I've seen it in poetry, it was uh, used for a group of people are called Liciniums. And anyway, I was fixus, so I was fixed in place, steti, I stood in lapidem. I was standing gallidus, I was standing cold, fixed uh, like a stone, in the way of stone. Nihil secusquam, not differently than uh, una, one from one of the statues or columns of the theatre. Uh, so that's how he was stuck in stone, just as if he was as a statue or a column of the theatre. Uh, Keteris, the rest of them. Nick Price. So neither before from the infernal underworld had I demersi, had I emerged, then Mylon Hospice, then my host Milo, accessited me, approached, and he injected his hand to me, grabbed me, and re him. I was struggling against him. Rosum again with Promicantibus lacrimas. So he's got a glittering tears or something in frequent singly blah 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 he's crying frequently um and he had, had tracks me he dragged me away sequel with himself with a bit of clemential violence so it wasn't really bad violence it was a bit of soft force and observatus via solitude and through by observing our solitary roads through certain i think that's anfractus is what i'm used to saying through certain uh, alleyways or something, he perduxed me to his home, Dome Um Suam. Me, I was maestum, he was still gloomy, and Etiam took, and even so then, uh, he was solacing me, uh, a f- fadibus with a words, uh, various words. He was trying to assuage my trepidum, his um, fear. Pretty much done for the day. A page and four lines is perfect amount to do. An anfractum, a bend, curved, crooked part, or a winding passage. So that's how he went home through um, a bit of bends. I guess the fractal means it's broken, and so that explains why it's called a bend. Anyway, Tarman. Nevertheless, not the indignation and the accusative of this injury. Uh, which was in Harrison, which was sticking uh, rather deeply, Altius, in my pectora, in my chest, Ulomoto, in any way, quivit, was he able to permulcre, to soothe it. Okay, that's how much indignation he was feeling. That's it for the day.